right, say hi everyone. Hi. This is Sam and I have Winter here and I have Joey. I have little helpers today. Can you guys say hi? Hi. All right, they picked out. We are going to read a Peppa Pig book called Learning to Share. Okay. Learning to Share. One bright summer morning, Peppa and her friends. Here, watch it. Guess it right here, Joe. Thanks. Peppa and her friends are all at the playground. Candy Cat is on a tire swing. Pedro Pony is going down the slide. Peppa, Susie Sheep, and Danny Dog are on the merry-go-round. Can you spin us really fast, Peppa asked Daddy Pig. Turn the page. Good job. Okay. Peppa's little brother, George, is at the playground too. George is a bit too young for the merry-go-round. Mummy Pig pushes him on the swing instead. Higher, says George. Not too high, George, says Mummy Pig. Ready? Turn the page. Thank you. All right, we gotta read this page. Squeak, squeak. Here are Rebecca Rabbit and her little brother, Richard Rabbit. They have come to play. Richard has brought his toy dinosaur. Turn the page. Thank you. Can I go to the merry-go-round too, Rebecca asks. Of course, says Daddy Pig. Hop on. Hee hee hee, Rebecca laughs. Let's go really, really fast. Squeak, squeak. Richard thinks the merry-go-round looks like fun too. In fact, he wants to hop on. Here, Joe, scoot over here a little bit so they can see the story too. Turn the page. Okay. Aw, uh, groans Peppa. If Richard gets on it, means we can't go fast. Richard is little, just like George. He is too young to go fast on the merry-go-round. It's okay, says Rebecca. Richard can play with George. No, says Richard. He wants to play with the big kids. George has, to, George has a toy dinosaur, just like yours. Mommy Rabbit tells Richard, let's go and see. All right, now you can turn. George, hold, George holds up his green dinosaur. Dinosaur, he says. Richard holds up his red dinosaur. Grrr, he growls. George and Richard both love dinosaurs. That gives Mommy Pig and Mommy Rabbit an idea. Here, Joe, turn the page. Thank you. George, can Richard play with your dinosaur? Mommy Pig asks. No, says George. Richard, can George play with your dinosaur? Asks Mommy Rabbit. No, says Richard. George and Richard do not want to share. Turn the page. Thank you. All right. George, it will be much more fun playing together if you share, says Mummy Pig. She takes Mr. Dinosaur and gives him to Richard. But George was not happy. Wah, he cries. <coughs> Richard, that was really nice of George, says Mummy Rabbit. Now let him hold the dinosaurs. She gives the dinosaurs to George. Wah, she cries, Richard. Sharing doesn't seem like much fun at all. All right, here in turn, scroll over the page. George and Richard always cry when they play together. Peppa says, says Peppa, they are just too little to play nicely. Can you big girls teach them how to play together, asks Mommy Rabbit. Peppa and Rebecca help George and Richard make sandcastles in the sandbox. See, playing together is fun, says Peppa. Everything is going very well until... George smashes Richard's castle with his shovel. Then, oops, then Richard smashes George's sandcastle with his shovel. Wah, they cry. Oh dear, this does not seem to be working. How can George and Richard learn to play together nicely? Hmm, says Mama Pig, I have an idea. George, what's your favorite thing in the whole playground? Mommy Pig asks. Seesaw, says George. George loves the seesaw, but he can't play on the seesaw on his own. He needs a friend to play with him. Squeak, squeak, hee, hee, hee. George and Richard have lots of fun playing together on the seesaw. Mummy Pig, Mummy Pig's idea worked. 
George and Richard have learned that playing together is fun, especially when they both share the fun with a friend. The end. Was that a good book? Yeah? All right. Bye, everyone. See you next time.